Welcome back to week three of Profit First Allocations, looking over my shoulder to see how this works in action. So I've updated my spreadsheet. I've taken where we ended with week two. My bank balances are sitting in this column here at the beginning. And to update what's happened, so I do allocations every Monday. So what's happened since last week, um, I've taken no money out of my profit account because um, it's not a calendar quarter end. That's the only time I take money out of my profit account. Now, owner's comp, I, I have two columns here, and I want to differentiate between money I've taken out of account because I've spent it for my business versus transferring. Um, and the reason why I transfer is because the way I have my payroll set up for my payroll, payroll for my business, it all, all the money comes out of my OPEX account of my, um, for payroll, okay? And I try to make all of my payments out of my OPEX account so that it doesn't muddle up any of my other bank accounts with extra transactions. So what I need to do is when I do every other week pay myself payroll, the money comes out of this OPEX account. So I need to reimburse it from my owner's comp account. So I pay myself a fixed salary and the amount of my gross wages plus the company payroll tax part um, it comes out to 41.40.38. So I had to take that much out of my owner's comp account and add it to my OPEX account so that that way the payroll was funded. So see how I had almost 6,000 in the OPEX account. I had to add 41.40 to it um, that increased the balance to 10,000 until payroll was processed. Um, in my tax account, I've made no tax payments because I haven't had any pay taxes due. Now, let me uh, clarify that this is for income taxes. The payroll taxes are being covered by this owner's comp account. So uh, for me, and then for, I have uh, one employee right now and payroll taxes would come out of the OPEX account because that's an operating expense for staff. So out of my OPEX account though, I have now paid, so I, I had to make the payment for payroll. I had to pay my rent. And then I had, um, so my rent is $6.95 a month. And then I had a print ad that I paid for, which was $1,100 that I paid by check. So that came out. And then that total is $59.35.38. So see how my bank account went from $5,900 um, oh, and then I, I paid out actually 5,900. I had to reimburse the 4,100 for payroll. So now my bank, my operating expense budget right now is 4,180. That's how much money I have to spend to operate my business. Um, my mastermind, I had no transactions in my mastermind account. Okay, so now that I have updated balances though, I need to do my allocations. So let's see what came in this week. Okay, so I had a good week last week. So 4698 came came in last week. So how does that work with allocations? So I'm going to add 4% to my profit account. 47% to my owner's comp, 9% to tax. 33 to OPEX. And my mastermind, I'm going to add a little over $300. So I've now allocated out all of last week's deposits. And um, now see how things are working. I've now, um, so even though I allocated, I had $4,698 come in, I paid out more than that. So my bank account totals went from $23,000 down to $22,000. So uh, um, I added a chart. Hopefully this will help. I'm going to start tracking um just to show how this is working. So in my profit account, um, it's hard to see on this chart, but bumped up just a little bit. Owner's comp went up a little bit from week one to week two, but when you'll see next week that when I add the trend, you'll see how it dropped. Uh, tax account went slightly up, but look how my OPEX, that's how I'm running my business. This operating account is running my business. I'm not running my business on the money coming in. I'm running my business on what's left over after I've paid myself. So I've paid myself first, between my profit account, my owner's comp, and my taxes, saving for those, I'm running my business on the rest. 
And then my mastermind, I've made sure that I had money set aside for my mastermind. So keep following and I'll see you on week four.